Welcome back to Montana this morning. In studio, we have a great group of folks here with us. We have Brandon from Valley Credit Union, along with some young entrepreneurs. Guys, give us a wave when I say your name. We have Bennett, Caden, and Danielle. Hi, good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning. So they are all here to tell us about a fun event coming up this week at the Babcock Theater. It's the Billings High School Pitch Contest. So. Brandon, I understand this is sort of like Shark Tank and it's called The Hive, right? That is correct. Okay. We're, we're giving the opportunity to some high school kids. Um, they're gonna come and pitch their businesses to a group of businessmen. And at the end of the day, someone's gonna win a very substantial amount of money to help get their business off the ground. Wow, that is pretty cool. So is this the first year that this has been going on? This is the very first okay. year where it came in 2019, but it got canceled, so here we are. Okay, and I wanna know students, we don't want you to give anything away that you're not supposed to before your big presentations, <laughs> but what can you guys tell us about your business ideas? Because this is such a cool idea. How about you, Danielle? Um, so I own Nelly Nicole Designs, so I have lip balm holders and stickers, so both are eco-friendly, and I'm trying to just create a more sustainable product. Okay, I love that. Can I try it? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, All yeah. right, what about you, Kaden? Uh, so uh, this is actually my apparel. It's Don't Shy Away, it's just uh, to like motivate people, and it's to, promote like comfort, uh, comfortability and confidence and uh, yeah. Okay, I love that and you guys are here on the morning news so <laughs> I think you're promoting that pretty well. Okay, what about you Bennett? And my business I'm about to start is Doggy Go, a double featured dog service business that is always on the go. Okay, very cool. And so what do, what do they do with your dog business? Yeah. Well, what I do is I go around to people's houses and I go pick up their dog poop and also walk their dogs. Okay, well, I mean, that's a pretty convenient service. I think a lot of folks <laughs> out there listening, we could handle that. We could handle not having to clean up our own dog poop, right? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Brandon, tell us more about this event. What do you want folks out there in the community to know? So what we're trying to promote is there's a lot of kids. This isn't um, necessarily all the college bound kids. We want to show people that through a little bit of hard work, you can take your dream and make it w whatever you want, um, that you don't have to go to college to be a success. You can be an entrepreneur. There's lots of successful people in the world who didn't go to school and they started their own businesses and very successful. Okay, very cool. And I see the information on the screen. Is this available for the public to attend? 100% it is. It's 2.30 okay. on Wednesday at the Babcock okay. Theater. 2.30 on Wednesday. Yeah. Can folks come and cheer the students on? We That's what we want to have Okay, happen. okay. Yes. yes. So how does it work as far as the investors? Is it really like Shark Tank? So there'll be people like saying, I like your idea, Danielle. I like your idea, Bennett. <laughs> yes, so what'll end up happening is there's five local businessmen that are gonna judge this. Okay. And then they'll get together at the end and determine a winner and then what Valley's going to do is give away $5,000 to get their business started and then the Northern Hotel has stepped up and given away $2,500 to the second wow. and third place winners to help get their business. We have advertising packages we're going to give away, mentorship through the Chamber, mentorship through Rock 31. They get all that for free. Wow, how cool is that? All right, well thank you all so much for being here and good luck on your yeah, little adventure with us. businesses. This is awesome. Yeah. All right, we'll be right back.